Hey, good morning, cats. This is actually the hundredth day that I've been out on the trail this year, um, either through hiking or doing a zero out on trail away from home. So it's kind of a big, <laughs> kind of a big number there. Uh, so last night it was, uh, it was pretty comfortable. Got quite a bit of sleep. Went down early because it was I was just wet and kind of cold and woke up and I didn't really want to put the wet and cold clothes on but I uh, tell you what I finally got moving and even though my clothes were all wet one <coughs> even though my clothes were all wet once I put this Appalachian gear hoodie on and it's made out of alpaca wool <coughs> it was like instant warmth even, you know it was damp and everything but it's still felt really good so I'm really good really glad I you know picked up this piece of gear so I'm still hoping for the Sun I think the Sun is really trying today to, to break through well we'll see um, but just a short day today 10 miles and I'm gonna sw swing into Mountain Harbor Hostel and uh, get, get cleaned up and dried out a little bit I'm passing Mountaineer Fall Shelter. That was a possibility for me to stay last night, probably up here in the tenting area. Uh, but it was it was about another mile from where I ended up staying, and thought I had a pretty pretty nice spot right next to the water. So just uh, you know, it's one of those decisions. Do you walk the other mile and be a little bit away from really a good source of water? Or do you have a, maybe a slightly better shelter site? I don't know, I was pretty happy with the shelter site that I had. Other than the mice that I had running around outside, outside my tent. Outside is the key word. Absolutely gorgeous. I gotta get up there for a look. Yes, sunshine, finally. Look at that, my shadow. Wow, it has been a while since we've seen that. Walking along the river here, I actually got off trail for about a tenth of a mile. Followed a little road, I guess, instead of the trail. And then it ended right at the uh, right at the river. It's like, well, I'm not crossing that. So I knew I wasn't supposed to. So I had a bushwhack up through the weeds. And then after a short distance, I found the trail again. So it wasn't all that bad. But sunshine, look at that.
So this is what I call taking a break and drying out gear I'm on the AT. Got my alpaca hoodie, a nice little chair. I can take a rest while things dry out and a backpack. Right along here is the trail. And sitting here pointing right down the valley right into the sun. It's a gorgeous sight.